Oh, look, um, something we can't control, can't do anything about, to be honest. We just got to keep preparing to play. Uh, we didn't expect to play yesterday at the practice game, but, you know, look, the, uh, the ground staff did a fantastic job for us to play then, so I think they'll, um, you know, they're working as hard as they can, and hopefully, you know, we get on tomorrow. Uh, well, the, the practice pitches yesterday, they played quite well, uh, but today they're a little bit more damp, um, so they spun a little bit more, a little bit slower. We don't know a lot about the stadium and the wickets, so, you know, look, we just got to prepare that it's sort of what we're going to face, so it's, that's the best that we can do. Yeah, look, we, um, we're, everyone touched wood is doing really well, they've trained well, we're prepared extremely well to play. Um, and looking forward to the challenge against Trinidad tomorrow. You know, they've been in this competition a few times and um, they've brought, brought along some very good players. Yeah, look, um, my experience, I have played a lot over here. I haven't done extremely well when I've played here, but I do know the conditions and, you know, it, I do know when you first come over, you've got to be on your game straight away. Uh, India is a place where if you're not on your game, everything consumes you, the wicket, the crowds, the weather, the hotels, everything just sort of gets on top really quickly. So the, the quicker you're on your game, the better. And, you know, look, as I keep, keep reiterating, our team is extremely well prepared and the, the boys are, are looking, looking forward to the challenge. And, and hopefully my bit of experience playing over here can help out a bit as well. You know, look, if the team is, the games are played in Australia, you know, our guys probably have an advantage as well because we're used to the wickets. Um, you know, Chennai, all those players, you know, that, they've had a very stable side for a long time and, and they've proved to be probably the best side in the world, you know, pretty close to it all the time. And, you know, Mumbai, you know, and Rajasthan and now Sunrisers are in it as well. Um, they're going to have an advantage, but, you know, look, I think you'll see also um, teams like Otago the other night, how well they played. Um, it, it's, it's really whoever comes out in the day and just starts well. You know, one, one performance on each side can win you the game. And, you know, if the wickets, you know, going into the second week start to spin a lot more, then I think you'll see the Indians, you know, become very strong. Yeah, look, he's, he's probably one of the most dangerous cricketers in the world in that format and one-day cricket. Um, you know, look, I think he pretty much plays the same way every time he plays and, um, you know, you still, you still got to play him on your merits and have your certain plans to him, but, you know, he's a player that can change that. Um, you know, I think every side's got you know their own player that can do that. You saw McCullum last night, 60 or 30 balls. Um, you know, it's you, you just got to keep playing what you can do and you know control what you can do as a bowler, as a fielder, and then you know hopefully you know he might miss Q1 or, or whatever, and you know just just keep trying to truck along that way.